The Lagos State Government has declared zero tolerance for sexual violence, domestic violence and child abuse. According to the Lagos State Domestic and Sexual Violence Response Team, 3,942 cases of domestic and sexual violence has been reported from January to August. On the average, 200 new cases have been reported monthly since May 2019. In view of this, the Lagos State Domestic and Sexual Violence Response Team, in partnership with the United Nations, organized a walk to create awareness on the advocacy against domestic and sexual violence. Our correspondent, Mercy, was there. We're just rounding up our work for this very simple but very unique event. It's the, it's the second day in the 16th day that the United Nations had set aside for about activities to mark violence against gender balance. And so Lagos State Government, through the Ministry of Justice and other arms of the government, deemed it fit that we need to have this work to further confirm and to indicate our full government support of our advocacy around the stop of child abuse The advocacy around rape against women and girls. They talk around domestic violence, sexual violence, and all other vices that are around abuse of children. Our government, by this work, confirms that we're totally against it. We stand against everything that speaks to this issue. And so we are using this advocacy to warn and to tell people to desist from it, to stay clear of it, because a full arm of law will be brought to bear on anybody or any institution or in any form that you found wanting. To the commitment of the Lagos State Government against all people who commit crimes against women, especially violence against women, rape against women, or, or, or any, any uh, male or female, rape against male or female, and also abuse of children, and also marital abuse in terms of violence and what have you. So this work is to dem demonstrate the state's commitment and zero, zero tolerance for all these acts of violence. I think this is a very good mood, especially when it concerns students. We are particularly with, uh, particular with students, you know. A lot of sexual harassment is ongoing almost everywhere. But the stand of Lagos State is that we must fight it. And this kind of campaign, we intend to take it to our schools in Lagos State. After this campaign today, we are going to have another one in our schools. So to make sure that these children are aware and that they should speak out, especially when you speak out, it will put an end to it. Though we will also let them know that this kind of campaign should be taken to homes. Let fathers, mothers be aware of what is going on and children should please speak out. See it and report it. See it and report it. End the silence. End the silence.